with the One Love lead in this final tie within Group A. Well, after the disappointment of Pranoy, we turn our attention to the first men's doubles, and it is the reigning world champions, Liu Cheng and Zhang Nan, up against the Indian pair of Arjun Madatil Ramachandran and uh, Ramachandran Shluk. So there, the world champions arrive first. And what an occasion for this Indian men's doubles pair. สนามที่สองประเทศทีมชายกลุ่มเอระหว่างประเทศจีนและประเทศอินเดียชายคู่มือหนึ่งประเทศจีนตัวแทนคือหลิวเฉินและจางหนาน ประเทศอินเดียตัวแทนคืออาจูนและรัมจันดันชรอกเซียงกรรมการพุทธศิษย์ that's a good attitude. Two delightful young men. I hadn't spoken to them before I arrived here in Bangkok. I've been following their results. Arjun and Schlock. And this is the first meeting, as you can see, between these two pairs. And that is predominantly because the Indian pair have been playing the lower tier of tournaments. The Super Series for the past 11 years, they haven't really emerged on the Super Series, whereas the Chinese pair certainly have been playing Super Series, albeit with different partners. Yu Cheng is 26 years of age, born in Samming City in western Fujian province, and he and his partner back up to their career high, enjoying their sixth week in total in their second spell as world number threes. Zhang Nan, 28 years of age now, born in Beijing. First male player to win two medals at the same Olympic Games, which is what he achieved in Rio, a gold in the men's doubles with Fu Haifang and a bronze in the mixed doubles with Zhao Yun Lei. They have uh, played uh, both ties so far and won both of their matches in 35 minutes. In the match against France, Tom Gickel and Ronan Laba. And against Australia, that was the first match against Chao and Sarasinga, the left-hander. So Schlock is 23 years of age, born in Mumbai. And he's a tall athlete, as you can see. That's 189. He used to be a singles player in his youth. And he and his partner, who turned 21 11 days ago, Arjun, born in Kochi in Kerala. And he, when he was a junior, used to play with Shiraz Shetty, one of the players who has not come here to Bangkok. Of course, Shetty is part of the number one ready men's play. doubles pair with Voranki Reddy on the world rankings. And there you can see that they lost on Sunday against the French pair of Kasode uh, and uh, Mayo. And then they beat Chow and Sarah Singa yesterday. So Eric Kurt from Denmark is our umpire for this one. Fabio Beppo from Italy is the service judge.
So, of course, the world champions are favourites against anyone they play against. Won the gold medal in Glasgow last year when they were the number eight seats, beat uh, Mohamed Hassan Ladies and, and uh, Rian Saputro right, in the final. Normally, India, represented by Arjun M.R. and Kamchandran Clark. China to serve, Changan to Arjun M.R. Come on, play. So incidentally, when Liu Cheng and Zhang Nang won that gold medal at the World Championships last year, that was their first ever title together. Extraordinary. Yeah, that will help settle the nerves. Good smash from One Arjun. Love. Good serve. Oh. Serve is over. One all. Oh my goodness, what a backhand. That is absolutely terrific. Virtually no backswing of the racket. Look at that. How did he generate that power? Oh, service fault called on Liu Cheng. Not below 115 centimetres, the experimental service rule. Got to be a little bit Three, cautious two. and careful not to get embroiled in the flat fast exchanges. There's great awareness of where the gap was. Smash the placement from Schlut. the formation the world champions like to adopt. Lu Cheng thunders down smashes from the back of the court. Very sharp at the front of the court. Yeah. Somehow, the young Indian pair have got to get themselves on the attack, in other words, hitting the shuttle in a downward direction. Oh, good return of serve. A little bit of good fortune, but we all need a little luck at times. Serve. They've been serving well, the Indian players. I know it's early stages, but I've been very impressed with their low serving. Yeah. 
ประธานล่าเนลเทกรรมการผู้จัดสิทธิชิ้นเทนแบทจากประเทศออสเตรเลียกรรมการกำกับการส่งรูปเดฟานเบจากประเทศออสเตรเลีย Wanted to just take the pace out of the shot. Seven, five. Amazing, amazing shot. Taking it early as he lunged forward there, Liu Cheng. And he's been wearing that strapping on his elbow for months, if not years now. Zhang Nan. Oh, that's very, very clever placement of the smash. Aiming towards the left Six, hip nine. of Liu Cheng. Saw that he was committed to the forehand defense. Look. In fact, got him on the left hip. That's perfect placement. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Over. Again, the right Seven, idea. Six. And with young players, I think it's always encouraging to see them going for the right sort of shot, trying to take on opponents. Even if there's one or two mistakes, it doesn't matter as long as you're trying to do the right thing. Oh, I think we missed it. Oh. 11, uh, six, Shook does the same interval. thing. So to the mid-game interval, with a five-point advantage, China with the world champions. And there's so much drift swirling around. Miss there from Jiang Nan. And then the miss hit from Schluck. Court two, 20 well, I was talking to Janor Jorgensen at the tournament hotel earlier today. Denmark, of course, played in the first match on this court here today, court number two. And he was telling me that 11, the wind was six. worse than ever. The drift Play. was swirling, he said. It that hard, I don't think the drift comes into the equation. Six. 
Oof. Uh, it was a very good interception, but it was just a little too flat. Oh, the back line. Look at the reactions here, though. That's wide. My goodness me. Nine sixty. A great elevation there. New chain. Look at this. Service fault called. This time on Jan Lam. That's two service faults. On a piece for the Chinese players. the second time he's done that, Jang Nan. From the net, he looks as if he's going to play the fast push. And then he just plays the delicate little block. Lovely. That's amazing. What a shot. Yeah, that's good as well. Flatter smash that time towards the chest of Chang Nan. His awareness of where opponents are, where the gaps are, it's absolutely superb. And with that wonderful touch from Jiang Nan, so China will gain point opportunities. 
Yeah. First time, 21-12 opening game. A little over 14 minutes of play. discussing the serve and the service faults. I think actually both the service faults came from the old game. Zhang <laughs> Zhang. The Chinese coach, Shen Chen Chi Chu. Seconds. Court two, 20 seconds. Court two, 20 seconds. Yeah, he's looking up high into the ceiling. Zhang Lan, I don't know whether it's the lights or whether he's trying to figure out Second where the game. drift is going. Good return. enough pace on it to make it very awkward for Schlock. dangerous to listen to this man. from the front of the court Two, three. and that's what they need to do and they're hitting the shuttle in a downward direction they can involve that net player oh, how did he get out of the way to play that good rally oh don't believe it. What a defensive shot from Jang Nan. Oh, that's probably as good as you'll ever see on a defensive shot. Oh. 
Yeah, that is the flatter smash again. Three, Getting the desired effect. Amazing reactions initially from the Indian pair. Five, three. Well, this is where the world champions are so clever. Especially Zhang Nan sees those gaps, calmly places the shuttle. Drop shot there from Schluck. Just watch where the shuttle lands. Five, Way in front of that front service line, which means it must be very, very tight to the net. Well, he played a winner from that position in the opening game with a cross-court smash. And that time over did it. are doing very very well here staying with the world champions in these early stages of the second game oh, terrific again. oh there's a challenge challenge here first challenge of this match Catch the line. Line judge was correct. One challenge remaining. Service over. Seven, six. Play. Yeah. He's found a gap again. Time and time again. Tactical awareness, absolutely superb. Jang Nan. Yeah, good defence. time that I've really had the opportunity to watch this young in Indian pair in detail and I can certainly understand why they've caused one or two upsets in recent tournaments the Asian Championships in the first round they beat Shanghai Siok and Kim Duk Yong of Korea won a three tournaments as well 2016 one in Nepal last year they won in Iran and Ethiopia oh. and their titles uh, to either international series events or international challenges 
And I think they're more than ready to move up a tier of tournament. Super 100s or Super 300s under the new World Tour. Unbelievable defence. Yeah, the change of pace is clever. Just long. So the world champions go to the mid game interval here in the second game with a two point advantage, having already won the first. Uh, the Indian pair are working them hard. Yeah, they're really fired up. No sign of the nerves that Schluck was talking about in his first match against France and Bastien Cossoudi and Julien Mayer. Oh, that's the first service error, I think, of the match. Indeed it is. Short, yeah, it's not even going over. This is where the world champions use their experience to just pile on the pressure. Play with a little more intensity. And the young Indian pair have to respond to that. they get on the attack, the Chinese pair, they tend to win the rally within a, a couple of shots. And that's the big difference, I think, between the two pairs, because when the Indian pair are 15, on the attack, 10. either they don't win the rally at all because their attacking play is then converted into their opponent's attacking play, 
or it takes them five or six shots to get the shuttle through their Chinese opponents. senses it's now or never as far as the Indian pair are concerned they've got to start closing down this gap four points is nothing can be closed down they have to believe in themselves of the net call for Zhang Nan. In Dan unfazed by this men's doubles. Lewis Lin Dan on a quest to become the first man to win six Thomas Cups. now or never. <laughs> yeah, well taken, well worked. And it's very, very good to see this fighting spirit. A simple put away and with it come five match point opportunities for Liu Cheng and Zhang Nan. One will do. 21-12, 21-15. Uh, but I can assure you the young Indian pair ought to be proud of themselves giving the world champions a real fight in that first men's doubles but their confirmation that Liu Cheng and Zhang Nang have won 21-12 21-15 in a match lasting 34 minutes this is the final rally 